Hello, today I'd like to show you how to do AM in LT Spice. For this we're going to make a carrier, we're going to make a signal, we're going to modulate the signal with the carrier, or in other words we're going to mix the signal and the carrier, and in the end we're going to do an FFT over the final mixed signal to see what we're going, what comes out of a mix. So for the carrier and the signal, we're going to need a voltage source two of them and we go to ground and bolt V1 is going to be uh, our carrier so we're going to make a sine wave around 0 1 high 1 volt and make it around 4k in hertz that is our carrier we're going to make it nice like this and then we have our V2 V2 will be our signal. It also will be a sinus wa sine wave, an amplitude of around uh, yeah a half. But also we have to. I'll leave it on zero for now for purposes. And make it 400 hertz lower than the other. Yes, like this. Actually, maybe 200 hertz. And I'm going to add another voltage source, but this time it's called BV. BV, because with BV you can add a function. But before doing that, I'm going to label these, these outputs of these two voltage sinus or dome generators, function generators. And the first one is the carrier, so I'm going to call it high, because it will be the high frequency. And the second one will be low because it's the low frequency. Then this one I'm going to ground it first, like this, and call it the voltage of high times the voltage of low. And this is basically it. I'm going to call this output mixed because it's the mixed value. And we're going to look at how it looks like in the time domain. We're going to make a simulation. Around 10 milliseconds is okay. Here we go. And then I'm going to look at this one. This is our high uh, full, uh, frequency. This is our low frequency. I think I'm going to make this just a little bit higher. About double. Yes. And that's perfect. In the mixed frequency, will we look at? It will look, will look like this one. And if we make this a little bit higher, it's easier to recognize, I think. Like this, yes. Here we have an AM modulation. Now, if you put this in the F, in the FFT, the mixed uh, voltage of the signal, you'll see two big peaks here, here. And it's around 40 kilohertz. It's basically 400 hertz down and 400 hertz up. But our carrier is not in the spectrum. This is because we forgot to add the DC offset because that's part of AM modulation. Let's try again. There's not a lot changing here, just a little bit. But if we look at the FFT of the mixed signal. There we go. Then we have also the carrier. So here we have the carrier, the lower frequency, lower band, higher band. And if we uh, combine them, so we take all these signals. There we go. Then we see here the lower band. The, the data and here we see our carrier with the sidebands 400 up and 400 down 